Ich nicht schicken, also nicht heute. Welcome back to the real life of Joe. This is Joe. I do music reviews and talk shit in mics, and it looks like we got a stranger over here. Who is what up, what you, up, sir? Tell the people who you is. Yo, it's millions of power. Thank you for having me. You know what I'm saying? Uh, please definitely appreciate the invite. But millions of power. You know what I'm saying? Rapper out of Cincinnati. What's good? So, how long have you been doing music? <sighs> Seriously, uh, been doing music since. I'm going to say 2015 because that's my first official release, but I've been technically doing music since uh, 2006. 2006? Oh, that's awesome. Mm -hmm. uh, I remember you did put in a, a bio on my website, mm -hmm. and um, I wanted to say, uh, one, congratulations, and I'm glad that you're here from COVID and the Appreciate um, it. damages. Um, what was that like, um, completing your album? Um, I'm sorry, what was the name of the album? Dying uh, Don is Easy. Don yeah, is I came out the easy. right back. How was that recording it with that? Uh, that was crazy because uh, I don't really have like a lot of, excuse me, okay. I got a mint, but I don't really have a, some, some of my memory is like actually lost wow. because I had, <clears throat> you know, COVID, then I had pneumonia, then I had MRSA, uh, so Jeez. just a lot of shit going on. I don't know if I can curse or if I can't. Yeah, you can. I curse like I said. Was okay, we here. Fuck shit, asshole. Uh, <laughs> nah, uh, <laughs> nah, I just, you know, I lost a lot of my memory, my long term, so some things i remember some things i don't mm -hmm. uh but it was uh it was a struggle uh like getting my voice back and uh man because like ah man i hate remembering this shit, but it was just a hell of an ordeal and uh for a long time like i literally didn't have my speaking voice wow. i say that to say uh like trying to record trying to get the voice back like it literally it just came back out of nowhere, you know what I'm saying? So it was it was a challenge for sure. That's good. So what inspired you to pursue a career in music and how was that inspiration evolved over time? What inspired it? Uh really my art. Uh I've always been artistic. I was born with the ability to illustrate. Mm -hmm. Uh still life is my favorite form of illustration. Uh, my uh but mostly my art, like I got, always had an eye for art, creativity, uh, you know, fashion, anything artistic, really. So, just my art. I, I went to school for graphic design, and that was a means to an end to uh, be able to design my own covers and whatnot. Uh, I didn't really do much of that. End up, you know, meeting other people uh, mm -hmm. who do stuff like that and who have more experience. But I still wanted to learn the skills to be able to do it and, you know, stuff like that. But mostly my art, to answer the question. So in other words, he was born with it. He had that Most dog definitely. in him from day one. Most he definitely. heard him. Now, can you share like a, a memorable, a memorable moment from your journey as a music artist that had had a lasting impact on you? Uh, quite a few, for real. Uh, early on, I tried to work with a, uh, another artist, fellow rapper. It ain't really work out. Uh, we we end up trying to like build like a trio. With uh, it was me, the rap, uh, the other rapper, and the singer, mm -hmm. trying to like you know. They don't do trios, no trios and duos no more. Really. Well, this was like 2010, you know oh, what I'm saying? Okay. So it was yeah. still kind of a thing, yeah. but it didn't work out. Uh, I learned a lot, you know, as far as creative writing because I had like input from two other artists, you know what I'm saying, fellow musicians and whatnot. Uh, but that's about it like it just didn't work out and, and ever since i pursued being a solo act you know what i'm saying still collaborating but that right there that situation like i ain't even gonna get into all the stuff that happened because it was some wild shit that happened but i'm just gonna say like literally like that I was like nah the, the group shit ain't for me let me just be a solo act and go from there but i did learn a lot for sure well, as, so as a solo act, um, what's your like approach? Your approach to your uh, creative process? Like, do you need a beat first, or you gotta feel something first, or you just go in the studio and just do your thing? Uh, everything starts at home. Uh, got my fiance in the crowd. And she is uh, gorgeous. I'm sorry, I'm distracted. Appreciate it. Appreciate <laughs> it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but yeah, just like everything starts at home. Just you know, I write. Like lyrics come to me. 
on a daily basis, you know what I'm saying, about any and everything. I could turn a whole bunch of shit into a bar most times. So it's just, it never turns off. So it, it just ends up being that it starts at home. But from there, then I conceptualize it, you know what I'm saying, and, and uh, you know, bring more substance and content to it and, you know, kind of get into telling my story through, um, you know, the, the process of starting at home and, you know, building the song or whatever. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I, nothing, nothing. The studio for me is a, it's like, that's like going to work, you know what I'm saying? Home is like, like, you gotta be prepared. So once you get to the studio, you just knock the shit out. Mm -hmm. Smart man. So, um, who would you say, um, what artist had your biggest influence on you? Uh, biggest influence, Tupac, for sure. Uh, I love, you know, his ability to, well, you know, he's passed, so, you know, I don't want to talk about him like he's present tense, but he's present. He's always present for me because... He's always in the music rotation, yeah, you know right? what I'm saying? <laughs> it's like, you know, that's my favorite rapper, artist, you know, in any genre, hands down. And, uh, you know, I just love his his ability to make a song about anything and everything and, like, show the, the you know, like, we're, we're walking contradictions. And it's like, that's, being, that's part of being human. Yeah. And like sharing that experience, you know what I'm saying? Feeling a way about multiple things, experiencing multiple things that affects you differently. So you can't just keep making the same song over and over. And that's my approach. I don't never make the same, I try not to make the same song twice ever. You know what I mean? So. That's good. That's really Tupac good. Tupac for sure. What's up? Y'all know I'm a biggie girl, so. I mean, biggie too, but <laughs> you, you can't help but be, you know, influenced by both of them. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Probably lyrically, I'm probably more influenced by. The, the likes of Biggie, Jada Kiss. Oh, that's probably my cameraman. Oh, so in the bio that you shared with me, yeah. you said you know pretty much almost everybody or know somebody that knows somebody and it might be A lot some. of people, for oh, sure. Clearly, you got your friend over here. I know him. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's my guy. <laughs> Shout out to Marshall Wayne. So um, who can we expect to be on your album? Hey. <laughs> uh, it's gonna be a ah oh man. If everything go right, it's gonna be it's gonna be a, 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 a some dope features. I'm gonna say that. I don't want to give away the names yet, cause you know stuff is still in the works for real. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm excited. I, I can't give no names just yet. Uh, you know. Ah oh, man, it's, I, I'm gonna wait. I gotta wait. I'll come back and, and let you know once it's out. You know what I'm saying? Once right. it's more concrete. It, we literally just started creating new music and recording, and, like linking up with artists and whatnot. So what, once it's confirmed mm -hmm. and it's official, then you know what I mean. Okay. So when does this album come out? No dates yet. No dates yet. Not the news joint. I mean, keep us on edge, y'all. Still got an album out right now. Dying is easy. Dying. You know what I'm saying? That's everywhere. You know what I'm saying? Uh, shout out to everybody who featured on that. You know what I mean? Uh, I am McCoy, Marshall Wayne. You know what I'm saying? A little bit of everybody. Sydney Monique, Destiny L. You know what I'm saying? Uh, a lot of artists on there. Y'all should check out Jess Lamb, Chris Renfo. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, check check that out, man. All right, well, congratulations on both albums. I'm looking forward it. to the new one that's coming out. For sure. Um, oh, and your engagement. I know I already said it, but I want to say shout out to your engagement. I just think Appreciate it's so cute. It. I love love. Appreciate um, it. Let's see what we got. Now, have you actually watched the show before? You, I have. Yeah. Yeah, I have. You All talk right. a lot of shit. I do. Not that yeah. much, do I? No, nah, you don't talk a lot. <laughs> but you, you're very sarcastic and very comedic. Yeah. I'll take that. Yeah. I'll take that. Okay. I definitely well, I definitely did my homework. I saw you drop the book. Oh, uh, thank you. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? I was trying to surprise, get a copy, and have you sign it on the show, but it ain't work out like that. But oh. I'm still going to get the book, though. Oh, that's so sweet. Yeah. I still thought that counts. I still thought that counts. Yeah. Oh, my God. That's probably my other guy. What is we doing here? You know the show not this long, right? I got an audience. <laughs> right, that point. <laughs> I always bring the line, man. That point. I see. That point. <laughs> Sure. I love it. I love it. Okay, so um, one thank you, thank you for watching the show, and thank you guys for watching the show, and thank you guys for being here. This, for is, sure. this is pretty cool. Um, so typically how this show works, I usually just listen to a new artist every week. Yeah. I don't really know what they look like. I don't really know what 
how they sound. I like surprises. Now, sure. this episode is a little bit different because you are the artist this week that we are listening well to. And so tell us, what are we listening to today? You want me to pick? Of course. Pick one uh, song. I'm going to have to pick uh, Diamonds and Pearls. Diamonds and Pearls. Uh, it has two dope features on it. I am McCoy and Destiny L. Uh, they like Destiny L, like my day, one of my day ones at this point. Uh, similar to Marshall Wayne. Uh, I am McCoy kind of becoming another day one for real. Uh, but it's just a great record, you know what I'm saying? It's a paying homage to one of my favorite artists, Lauren Hill. She's actually the artist who inspired me to actually start rapping. Oh, uh, awesome. With Tupac, I just enjoyed him, but. You know, Lauren Hill had the bars, so. She did. Yeah, so. Well, she did. Shout out to Lauren Hill. Shout out to Miss Hill. But yeah, Diamonds and Pearls, man. I'm dying is easy. Let's get it. All right, I'm going to go ahead and pull this up. Welcome back, guys. Here we have Millions of Power. We're about to tune into his song, Diamonds of Pearls. Hopefully, Diamonds and Pearls. Dim- Let's get it. Diamonds and Pearls. Yes, sir. Hopefully, he don't swing on me. I am nah, out now. No, <laughs> uh, We don't condone <laughs> domestic uh, violation. Has uh, not hit in the bitch. I'm joking. Boondocks, y'all. Boondocks. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, Diamonds and Pearls. It's my turn. If I ruled the world and everything in it, niggas that can't stay in their lane and JFK in it. So you bitch niggas to God while I praise women, that's why wifey keep calm. I look at everything different, especially when I'm on that edible or getting paid, nigga. Got a family to feed, doing what it take, nigga. All my own masters can't let them lynch me in them slave dealings. If the death don't see the signs, what can I say, nigga? Looking like church money, uh. Dealing roof missing, or the steak with the lobster. 42 sipping, my money be no good. Don't do Favors a do prison that mean everything free. What kind of life is you living? See me out quick and smile like a tooth missing. Bible on the dash where they see what only a few witness. I ride around top down with a coupe vision telly with a pool in it mansion with a stool in it. I need that boy. Oh. Around when that money yeah. goes, same niggas keep yeah, trying to call me oh my on my money, money phone. Cause lame niggas who gossip, we got a lot of dead beats. So they used to quitting before the job done. Like jab, but be high in their hands when the cops come gun talk. But you facing a nigga who really shot son. But what you get for playing the tough guy role? I'm trying to drop some off the lot and keep my wristwatch foes. Cause some men falls and the yours, whole hood got those. Cop that Bosky, I don't care what that old nigga got sold. Listen, young niggas get paid, that's great advice. Fuck whoever saying your name, they hate for life. Keep your soldiers fair, but don't trust your mans with the knife and quit pillow talking with hoes. You know they ain't even your type. Keep shining, you know them diamonds and pearls, dirty dancing. And make sure all your meagles wealthy and handsome. Let's like get diamonds and pearls. Let it hear it like when your favorites is back, make it his. Pray that one hit, bring them back. No who let them know if they rollin' the mission is black. Empire state of mind ain't even bigger than that. Rightful led to the throne, don't plan on them giving it back. And some won't be down for the cause, but I'm slowly living with that. I'll admit it for years that had my head in the bind. But leave it up to them, it seemed like it's never the time. Had me under that spell, done my way through that fire. Just to laugh at the end, boy, I'm the red and divine. In other words, that just mean I get better with time. And I'm better this time, I won't let up this time Got my foot on their neck, I hope I don't sever a spine If I do, I make sure I do it one leg at a time Pray my moon, show you what you don't get in these rhymes If ever we shine Like diamonds and pearls Shine brighter than the sun Shine brighter, shine brighter Like diamonds and pearls Like diamonds and pearls Go shit out, man, go get that
Huh? Te- technical. Uh, yeah. That's all right. It was only 20 seconds, but shit, it was fire from the beginning. Okay, did y'all hear what I just heard? Oh, my God. Once again, that was millions of powers in his song, Diamonds and Pearls. Oh, my God. Don't forget to drop a comment and tell us how you're feeling about the song. uh, Engage, man. Tell us. Engage. uh, Tell the people where they can find you at, your Instagram and all this Everywhere, man. There's millions of power. Everywhere except uh, Snapchat, but I don't be on fucking Snapchat. They for hoes anyway. You don't need to be on there. There you go. Mm-hmm. Man. Hey. Uh, uh, <laughs> but yeah, millions of power everywhere, man. TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, your mama, huh? Yeah. Everywhere, man. Oh, my goodness, man. <sighs> that was so good, man. I, I hate to say this. I hate to say this, but... I think that was the one of the best songs I had on the show this season. Yeah, appreciate like, that. oh my goodness. Yeah, that was really fire. I wasn't expecting that and I was scared a little bit, but that was some <laughs> that was some fire. We get that a lot. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But you know, we put a lot into our music, man. And I know I'm saying we even though it's an interview about me, but you know what I'm saying? I always shout out everybody I work with, everybody that be always willing to collab. Speaking of, shout out my boy Lee John, you know what I'm saying? Cold with the visuals and the cuts, you know what I'm saying? Uh, it's like niggas been rocking, and you know I just appreciate everybody, man. You know what I'm saying? Everybody who been down, everybody who down now, getting down. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, even you. You know what I'm saying? It's like extending this invitation, man. This is huge to me, like you know, because this the beginning. You know, this the new beginning, really for me, because you know, uh, it's been other people who definitely like you know. Try to put me on and, and you know give me looks, you know what I'm saying? But uh, you know, I, I just I just appreciate everybody, man. That's awesome, man. Like you, and I love that you have such a good support system too. I feel like For that's sure. uh, very yeah, that's important. My baby. As someone, it's my baby. Do y'all want to say hi to the camera or anything? Come on, baby. Just say hello. Sorry, just say hi. Nah, let these whores, <laughs> prostitutes, know. <laughs> Oh yeah, sit on my leg. <laughs> Breastfeed me. How long you guys? Doing? How long you guys um been together? Or we've been together for eight years. Eight engaged years. for one. Mm-hmm. When is the wedding? Coming soon. Can Coming I come? Soon. <laughs> you don't got anything, me. Okay, I know that shit's expensive. Okay. <laughs> oh, that is so amazing. Okay. Baby, right here. Oh my god, I can't so, wait. I'm digging in this album. This is something I'm definitely gonna play when we leave this show. Yeah, okay. Sure. I'm actually glad you didn't. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Literally. Dying is easy. You understand? You, understand? you hear me? Real talk. Uh but nah, uh, I'm actually glad that you didn't. You know what I'm saying? Like like getting you know, get into it too much if at all before the show because you got this that reaction the yeah. on the show, you yeah. know what I mean? So they can see like it's a genuine reaction and ain't somebody you know, like, oh, okay, they already knew each other. She she been hip to the music. She been a fan. You know what I'm saying? This is just more of the same. It's like, nah, you, you, you know, you extended this invitation because I'll support, you know what I'm saying, the show. It's like, and then, you know, moving forward, it'll be mutual. You know what I'm saying? So, again, thank you. You're very welcome, man. Like, what I tell y'all all the time, we are on a rock in the middle of space, just floating, don't know when we want to drop. Okay, you support each other. Okay, that's all we can do. For sure. That's all we can do. Like, what do you For say? Sure. Dying is easy. Collab. <laughs> don't compete. Collab. You understand? Collab. Rip. I know, that's right. I'm so excited to dig into this album. When you do, though, like you got to give me your immediate reaction but i will suggest you listen twice it's a heavy listen mm. it's a lot of content it's a lot of subject matter it's a lot of it, it's it's layered you know what i'm saying mm. so and i'm i'm hella lyrical on purpose but it, it came natural i ain't force it you know what i'm saying but it's 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 heavy it's a heavy listen i'm i'm, a, I'm prefacing you know what i'm saying it's a heavy listen so you know everybody's like Everybody love the music that has, you know, listened to it and tapped in, but it is a heavy listen. It's it's very, it can be emotional for sure. Ooh. Some songs probably will stop you and like, you, it's gonna probably take time to get through the shit, uh-huh. but you know, it just extends the life for me. So. How long did it take you to uh, make this album? <sighs> oh man, um, a, a few years, it had to be. Uh, so I started writing it. 
Honestly, that's that's good. Uh, that means you put a lot of thought in that. Almost into definitely. It. I like um, what I've noticed now, at least in the music industry, a lot of people they just throw out albums and they don't sound as like. They put care yeah, yeah, yeah. into it, if that makes sense. They oh, just nah. push something out just to have something. Nah, we ain't doing as that if over they're here. rushing, but I'm glad you took your time with For it. Sure. And even it, from that one song I heard, it definitely shows. Yeah, so. and it's just more of that. You know what I'm saying? It's just more of that for sure. Uh, when you know, you'll see when you listen. Well, you'll hear when you listen. But, oh, yeah, I'm telling you, you know. man, it's on the way. Um, yeah. Okay. Definitely put a lot into it though. Y'all, I usually talk show on the show, but what the fuck can I say? Well, I got nothing to say. Okay, that was fire. Okay, Put from beginning foot in it. You know what I'm saying? And and he got a great personality to back it up too. Support oh, yeah. system. This is you going places, sir. You, you almost there. Likewise. Like, oh my god, that was amazing. Well. Mm-hmm. Y'all, this amazing, is, uh, huh? Unfortunately, I feel bad because this is such a short and sweet episode. Cause <laughs> you shut me up. Oh my god, shut it down. Shut this shit well, guys, down, man. There you have it. We just got finished listening to Millions of Powers, Diamonds yes, and Pearls. His album, Dying is Easy. I'm about to bump this shit on the car. Most definitely. And he got another album coming out. What's the name of the album? Do you have one? Yet? Should I tell her? I've been, I've, been, I've been using the hashtag. It's called a la carte. Should I announce what we're doing? Oh, okay, I'm gonna keep that on the low low. I'm sorry, we got keep secret haters behind the camera now. Gee, they was cool, but now they telling them they ain't gonna tell me nothing. Well, I'll tell you off cam. <laughs> I'll tell you off cam. You know what I'm saying? For sure. But only re- oh, like, ah, oh, it's just, I ain't gonna, I can't say it on cam yet, man. It's all right. Yeah. It's okay. But... We, got some, we got some, we got some shit in store. <laughs> I'm so I'm excited. Yeah. I'm all here for you. Got a fan in me. Appreciate it. Appreciate it, man. Well, guys, that's all we have today. Thank you so much for watching the Real Life of Joe. Please be sure to follow Millions of Power. Please do. His, but even if y'all don't, keep supporting. You know what I'm saying? Her show, man. It's a dope ass show. All she don't do nothing but support artists, man. It's like if you ain't already tapped in or tuned in, man. It's like what the fuck are you doing? You know what I'm saying? And I mean that literally. Like you should be looking. For places, you know what I'm saying, where your content can live. And if you're an artist, you know what I'm saying, you should be supporting channels like this. Even if they ain't extending their hand or opportunities to you, you should be supporting it because these type of platforms support you. You know what I mean? Yeah. Thank you for watching The Real Life of Joe. <laughs> this is Joe. I do music reviews and talk shit. And, and thank you again for having me. And shout out to Timeless too, man. You know what I'm saying? This is going to be one of our new homes, man. Look like. Oh, you know, you know, part we'll talk about it off camera. I'll break right, off oh, camera. Okay. Yeah, that's <laughs> off camera. You, know, you gotta have an after hour show out this bitch. Oh, that'd be fun. Yeah. Don't get me. Oh, don't let me get no potion. Oh, that off air, man. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. Thank you again for watching, and I will see you next week. For sure. <laughs>